Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in again. Today we're going to be talking about natural selection. So, natural selection, it can sort of be summarised as survival of the fittest, which is probably a term that you've heard before, but today we're going to be running through the actual process. So essentially when you have a population of a certain species, there will be variations in the traits in that population. So what I mean by that is that there'll be differences in the phenotypes between individuals of that species. So for example, in a population of cows, some of those cows would be white and some might be black or brown. Okay, so there's variation in the coat color in that population. Now what happens is environmental suction pressures, that could be climate, that could be a disease, will act upon the phenotype of that population so that individuals with traits that are more favorable are more likely to be able to cope with that pressure and therefore more likely to survive than those which don't have the favorable traits that will allow them to cope with that pressure. This means that over time, those with the alleles conducive to that favorable trait will increase in the population. So we'll have an increased frequency of that particular allele. And this means that over time, the population will change to suit its environment and be able to cope with those selection pressures. Thanks for watching guys, make sure you check out our other videos.